What's up guys, it's Phil back here with Grand Vapor Station and today I will be bringing you the Tiger Panzer from MCV Philippines. That's these bad boys right here. They come in stainless steel and copper. I'm gonna go ahead and take a little rip right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you the copper one a little bit later, but let's go ahead and go in depth on the stainless steel Tiger Panzer from MCV. So voila, there it is. So uh, if you remember the original, it looked uh, like, had all the ridges in it like this one does. But to me, after really uh, using this item and vaping with it, it actually looks a little more futuristic to me. Uh, the lines are a lot spaced out and cleaner. If you see right here, it says Tiger and it says Pro Series right here on the front. Uh, top still has the whole uh, gear thing going that uh, Joy did from MCV. We go to the bottom, still serialized, has a cool little tank logo. Uh, it's tubular design on the stainless steel one, uh, has uh, the tubes to fit 18490, 18500, 18650 batteries, has the copper uh, button on the bottom, has the little brass accent right here. I will go ahead and start with the top cap. Let me get this off. So, has a copper floating positive pin. It's adjustable. Um, and actually, what's cool about this one is the insulator. You're able to unscrew it. It's not just jammed in there. It's not just stuck in there. So if anything happens, it's threaded. So you can actually unscrew the whole insulator if you have to replace it or something. So I'm just gonna screw it back in. That's the top cap. Like I said, it's a tubular one designed, so you actually just take off the tubes. And depending on what battery size you want to use, uh, that'll determine which tubes you use. So with all the tubes on, it's 18650 mode. Still have the ventilation holes toward the bottom. There's actually four, one right under the Pro Series logo. Another cool thing that they did was on the lock ring right here, they made it a hexagonal shape. So it's still, the lock ring is physically round, but he made the edges uh, with a hexagon shape so that it's easier to unlock and lock just to hold on to. If you can see that right here, I have like a grip on it. Let's go ahead and take the bottom cap off. So you still have the Copper contact right here at the bottom. It's still a reverse locking thread lock ring. Still a spring in there. Nice throw on it. It's got a pretty nice throw on it. Still got the grommet in there. So for me, uh, I always like the original Panzer. Uh, most of the MC MCV stuff that comes out, we've, we've had on the site and all the products have not failed to impress me with craftsmanship. And um, for the Pro Series Tiger Panzer, uh, it's not going to end there because I like this a lot. And like I said, it does come in copper too, which is the one I'm using right now in my personal collection. So I'll give you a little side by side. Here's the copper one with the little boy on top, all MCV. Uh, the copper one is pretty much the same, except the only difference is the copper is not tubular. It's just one piece, so you can't use 18350, 18500, unfortunately, on the copper. So if uh, you know you're gonna be going 18650 all the time, all the way, might as well just get the copper one. But uh, you know, you wanna switch it up, go a little shorter, you have a tall Addy, like a big dripper, or even a K fun or something you wanna throw in there, and you wanna go shorter, then you go with a stainless steel. So overall, uh, the Pro Series performs very well. Uh, I don't have any of the upgrades on it. Uh, there are upgrades available. You can get magnets, silver contacts, but I've never found the need to grab the upgrades because they work really great straight from uh, when I've gotten them from the manufacturer. Uh, they are all serialized. Uh, Grand Vapor Station right now has low serial numbers. Uh, stainless one right here is 143, and I have 179 uh, for the copper one in my hand right now. So you can check the site uh, to see uh, what serial numbers we still have available. I would definitely get one of these if you guys are an avid collector for the MCV stuff. Uh, very worth it. Uh, let me take a couple rips on the little boy.
Yeah, I haven't had a misfire or anything. The lock ring works great. Copper starting to patina. Uh, everything on it feels solid, especially the mod itself. Even with no battery in it, this thing is solid. This thing is still exactly uh, like the original. It's a Panzer, it's supposed to be like a tank, but it's kind of more like futuristic clean lines compared to the older one. So yeah, the Tiger Panzers are both available on GrandVaporStation.com along with the MCV Little Boy. Make sure to follow Grand Vapor Station on YouTube, subscribe to our channel, make sure to go to Facebook and Instagram, follow us at Grand Vapor Station. You can follow me on Instagram at Phil underscore GVS for just cool product reviews, cool vape pictures, anything vape related and my personal life. So um, just go ahead and go to the website, check us out and we'll check you guys out next time.